gallery clocks, I think, are, are popular today because people are use, utilizing this type of clock for decorating. Instead of a mirror, instead of a picture, something like that, a lot of times because of the size of the clocks, people are using them as not only you know, a clock, but it's a decorative piece as well. And typically your size is going to start around 24, 25 inches and go up got a big one in the window that's 49 inches. I think clocks in general, it used to be that uh, well, your grandfather's clock is not your grandfather's clock anymore, that, uh, whereas the traditional styles of clocks, particularly floor clocks, there was a time period when most of the clocks, the floor clocks, were, were strictly that, or you had the clocks where the clocks had a narrow waist on them. The head of the clock and the base of the clock were the same size, but the center portion of the clock got smaller. We see very little of the narrow-waisted clocks today, and, and what, the, what the clock manufacturing companies have done over time is that they have, they have um, um, tried to look at furniture trends and um, try to make clocks that are going to go with today's furniture trends. So uh, it's not just broken pediment with a finial. We have clocks that have a round head to it or maybe they're flat topped. So, and, and there are clocks out on the, on the floor here that, that are more of a contemporary look as opposed to a traditional look. Some of the clocks, depending on the material that's being used, um, some of them are real wood and some of them are going to be um, a, a resin, a cast resin which gives the look of wood. It's not as heavy, it's not as expensive. So some of the wood clocks may get you up into the you know, low to mid $300, uh, but more of the resin variety is gonna certainly be cheaper. Let's talk a minute about cuckoo clocks. Uh, cuckoo clocks are, again, it's, a, it's really a nostalgia thing. Uh, a lot of people have them, a lot of people have had them over the years. Uh, typically, um, people go to Europe uh, to visit, or you've got a, a child who is in the military and stationed in Europe, somewhere a cuckoo clock's gonna happen. Um, generally speaking, you've got cuckoo clocks that'll run for one day and you've gotta wind them daily, or you've got cuckoo clocks that run for eight days. Uh, some of the cuckoo clocks are gonna be uh, more what we would call a um, hunter style, which has the uh, carving on it and the animals, versus what we would then call the cottage style, which has more sort of, looks like a little house and people and all that. People come to Tierman's because, first of all, our selection. Uh, we have clocks that, that'll start uh, at $15 or, or less, um, they, uh, but then they, they go up to many thousands of dollars, um, whether it's a, a, an alarm clock, um, and some of those alarm clocks will have a, a Snoopy on it or may have a cow on it that moves when the alarm goes off. Um, we have all kinds of wall clocks, those that just tell time as well as those that will not only tell time, but will uh, chime and strike. The other thing about the, why, did, why to come to Tierman's is uh, we service what we sell. Um, if inevitably, a new clock gets into the home, there may be a problem with it. That's what warranties and guarantees are all about. But rather than have to uh, be, you know, uh, uh, contract somebody who's outside of the organization to go and do repair work, you know, we have our own repair people right, at, right here on the on staff.